it's me, Claudia Higgins, and I am here to do a makeup tutorial for you. I've uh, been looking on the internet for a good old makeup tutorial uh, to help me out, to help me be more beautiful. And uh, I must watch 10, 15 videos, and every single one of them, the gal is sitting there and she talks for 5 to 10 minutes before she even starts applying the makeup. So, I ain't going to do that. Ladies, stop doing that. Ain't nobody want to hear about where you bought your makeup, uh, about your baby, about any of that nonsense. Just get to putting the makeup on. That's what I'm going to do. Now, before I put my makeup on, I always start my day off with some hair cream remover. I put it here on my mustache, on my chin, sideburns, you know, anywhere I've got excessive hair. I'm not going to do that right now because I already did that. Now let's get to the next step. First step is powder. I'm going to put some powder on there. All over your face to get the greasiness off of there. And uh, I don't even know what kind this is because the top fell off. I'm going to put it on your eyes like so. And this here is, a, is only for a daytime look. All them gals be in there, okay, see, I bought this at, uh, at MAC. It was $400. This thing probably cost me $2, if that, and I probably had a coupon. So you've got the good powder base. Now you want to apply some blush, or rouge, as we uh, used to call it back in my day. Going to get Now remember, this is the daytime looks. So they're going to go light. You're just going to put some there. Put some there. Easy. Next, of course, is some eyeshadow. I have a palette of colors, and this also has no top on it. Probably uh, from the dollar store, too. Maybe Dollar General. I'm going to pick a light color for the day. Pink. I'm going to pick pink. And I'm just going to put it right there. Like so. See how nice that looks? It really evens out the skin tones and things. And just put it all the way up to the top. Now if you want to get fancy for your daytime, you could have two colors. I, I used the pink, now I'm going to use this, I don't know what it is, mauve. And just make a line right there up in the crease. And, uh. That'll about do it. Uh, to complete my look, going with a very light colored lip gloss. Because you don't want people to think you're some kind of whore. So I got the lip gloss. Now this has completed my daytime look. I'm ready to go to the church program. Now on to our nighttime look. We can just use the base that we used for the uh, daytime look. You get home from work or whatever. I'm going to go to the nightly uh, church program. Just put more powder on, get rid of that grease and whatnot. There's two crucial things with the night look. You're going to have to get a lot of blusher because you want to look real sensual like you just gonna do it real hard like keep putting it on there to see the difference this side is gorgeous this side has yet to be made gorgeous you just gonna push as hard as you can they look about even all right sometimes i like to put it on my nose but i have rosacea so bad my nose is already red so if you have rosacea I would not recommend placing blush on your nose. For the nighttime look of eyeshadow, I'm going to go with this pretty blue. It's a classic color. Uh, blue. You just want to put it all over your lid like so. Oh, Lord. You don't want to do that. That looks terrible. You're going to put it all up and up your lid. 
you're just going to put as much as you can because it's night time and people can't really see your makeup. So you really have to put it on thick. That looks about good. The last crucial step for your nighttime look, folks, is some red lipstick. And you just put it all on, all on your lips. Now, I like to put it a little bit on the outside of my lips. It makes my lips look fuller. Like one of them Kardashian gals. Just as gorgeous as can be. Then I put my glasses on. <clears throat> now, for a special evening out, if you really want to jazz things up, you could get some lip gloss and just put on on top of that. And your lips will look juicy and kissable. Ready to smooch. So, there we go. Easy as pie. Let's review. Do not talk for five minutes before your tutorial. Don't show us every product and brag about how much you spent on it. And three, this face says it all, folks. All right, now, thank you for watching my makeup tutorial. All right, now.